Hallelujah, glory to God. This is Prophetic Intercession with Amel. You are welcome. I feel privileged to bring you this prophetic message from the Lord. Don't let, don't let this spend another day in your house. Don't let this spend another day in your house. This prophetic word is for someone you have been crying because you feel that like the devil has been oppressing you. You've been going through demonic attacks and oppression and you have been crying. <clears throat> and God says, now is not the time for you to cry. Now is the time for you to take charge and take authority. The Bible says God has given us powers to trample upon snakes, scorpions, lions. And he says that by no means shall these things harm us. Now, this is not literal. It is figurative. God is by this saying, he, is, he has given us the power to handle difficult life challenges. And he says, by no means shall they prevail against us. So you've got to stop crying and you've got to start taking charge. You've got to send the devil packing from your house. Send the devil packing. Tell the devil you have no place here in my marriage. You have no place here in my family. You have no place here in the lives of my children. Send the devil packing and he will flee. The Bible says, resist the devil and he will flee. Mark your territory. Tell the devil you can only come this far. We are superior spirits. The Bible says that God created us in his, li in his likeness and in his image. And during creation, God told the sea, you can only come this far. You cannot go beyond this area. That is exactly how you've got to treat the devil. Tell him you can only come this far. You cannot come close to my home. You cannot live in my family. Send the devil packing. Do not let the devil spend one more day having a, a, um, a place of authority in your life and in your family. You've got to take charge. You've got to be responsible and pack the devil out of your house. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless you, keep you, cause his face to shine upon you. May he be gracious to you and give you peace. In the mighty name of Jesus, amen.